What is up YouTube? It is Nordic Beast here and in today's video you're just gonna be watching some extremely good search and destroy gameplay that I got a couple days ago when I was streaming and I just wanted to bring this to you because this was one of the best S and D games that I have gotten in a very long time. But yeah, this was just a really good gameplay and I wanted to bring it to you. But rather than that, I just wanna say thank you guys so 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 much for all the support lately. You guys have just been phenomenal with leaving likes and commenting and like kind of giving showing me your guys support and I just really do appreciate it and it really does kind of motivate me to like keep making videos and stuff so again I do want to say thank you guys so much for all the support but rather than that guys there is one thing I kind of want to like talk to you guys about and that would definitely be DLC 5 now I know there's been like a lot of controversy if DLC 5 is real and or if it's fake or no what's just going on with it but in my opinion I know like a lot of people just want to say it's real but like I truly believe that DLC 5 is definitely going to be coming out probably relatively soon like probably within the next I'd say about a couple months because it's just we have so much information about it and it's not like we've had any of this before you know so like Back in Black Ops 2, and even like before that, we've always wanted like a DLC 5, but we've never had like information like we have had now, like with like retailers like accepting pre orders for it and stuff like that. Now, I don't want to say that this is 100% confirmed, but like there is just so much information that we have about it. I mean, I don't think so many people could just come together and make all this stuff up when. A lot of it's just not just regular people off the streets, you know, like I mentioned. There's retailers that are accepting pre-orders for this. And most stores, like, won't accept pre-orders for something that's not going to be coming out, you know. So it's just, like, really absurd to, like, say that it's not going to come out, you know. I mean, because I know I just keep saying it, but, like, we have so much information. I mean, if you go on YouTube and just type in Black Ops 3 DLC 5, you can find 101 videos of like what evidence we have about it you know there's articles online there is videos obviously made about it and it's just even like the higher youtubers have like so much information about like why they think that DLC 5 is real and like I said earlier guys like I know like we've been wanting this for such a long time and we haven't gotten it for a while but even like we've went as far as to like come up with release dates of when it could come out like, I know, um, a video I just watched recently, actually, a, uh, guy of the name of COD Zombies HQ, he was predicting that the DLC would come out on about June 20th, which is right after E3, so it does make a pretty good amount of sense that if they were going to, like, have this DLC 5 come out, it would definitely be after, like, a huge event where it would, like, be planned for everybody to see, you know? So it's like, I don't know, to me it's just really hard to say that we are not going to be getting DLC 5 when there's just so much evidence about it, you know? We've had leaks on Reddit and stuff like that, and they have always usually come true about stuff like this, and I know they don't always come out with the truth and stuff, but, like, to me, like, a lot of the things I've seen on Reddit usually do come true. That's why, like, I'm kind of 50-50 when it comes to this. But, like, I really just want to say that there will be because I know I just keep rambling on about this. But, like, I know that the evidence that we have, it's just, it's way too much to say no. Like, I know that sounds absurd. But, like, to me, it's just, with all the evidence, it's just that... We, we have it, you know? I mean, I know, like, that doesn't make sense at all, but just knowing that we have this evidence and it is to our disposal, and even, like, videos on, um, YouTube and non-YouTube that have, like, leaked this stuff have been taken down, and usually Activision or Treyarch, whoever the studio is that's making a game, if something's, tr like, true, they're not gonna keep it up, because... It would be like a pre-announcement of which they want to be able to give out to the community themselves. So to me, it's just if this stuff is online and it is being taken down by the developers, then to me, it's just, it has to be true because there's a lot of stuff on just the 1 through 4 DLCs that they took down because, you know, it was kind of leaked and they don't want their content to be leaked if it's true. So... 
with that being said, I mean, that's all I really have to say. I know I just kind of rambled on and on about it, but to me, it's just, I, that's what I believe. I mean, you don't have to believe with me. You can say, I'm completely full of shit, or, you know, you'd be like, yeah, I agree, or I agree with certain parts, or whatever. But to me, that's just what I believe, and I hope you guys can respect my opinion. I mean, I know it's not confirmed, but anyways, I guess that's really it for today's video. And I just want to thank you guys so much for the support again. And make sure you guys subscribe if you guys haven't already. And leave a like on the video. And let's see if we cannot get to 5 likes. Because that would just be really good. And again guys, thank you so much for the support. And I will see you guys next time.